Alright guys, so I'm here doing some physical banner summons. Um, I've done a whole bunch of these already. They're kind of ready pre record I was doing them in bed last night. I just didn't want to get up to actually record, get my computer restarted and everything like that. So I have a whole bunch of stuff that's going to be pre-recorded right now. The, the first couple summons, the, the, the one where you see 107 stones, um, that's going to be live. That's what I'm doing right now. World Tournament is currently live. I haven't started playing it yet. Um, I kind of, like, I, I want both, obviously, of the support units that are here. Uh, personally, I really want the physical one, uh, the physical boo, uh, just because I really want the physical extreme team. Um, in terms of the other units, I'm not, I don't really want either of those god cards. I would like some more of those trunks. Definitely go tanks. And I, this is the only Super Saiyan Goku in-game I do not currently own. Triumphant Light, Super Saiyan Goku, he is a Doken Awakening. And I don't need to use Elder Kai's on him because I grinded out when the One Piece crossover came. I literally grinded out every single card that needed to be done for Super Saiyan Goku's. So, at wait, every Super Saiyan Goku in the game would have, a, would have a Super Attack 10. And I also grinded out an additional 9, which ended up being used. So I have 9 more of those Goku's waiting for that Triumphant Light. Um, and you'll see in the, other in, the, in the future all the other cards that I pulled. Um, fortunately, I didn't pull anything good, so, well, uh, what, either of these two, that's why I'm doing this one more time. So that's kind of a little bit of spoiler for the last one, but I did pull some good cards, some good units. Um, I really want, um, I think I need, like, one more super attack of this guy, uh, to get the, uh, strength one, super attack 10. Uh, so he's SA9, and both of these are good. I really want more of these, uh, white hot face-off Gokus for the physical god Goku cards, that way I can get him dope and feed them into the super attacks. But anyway, uh, let me go ahead and start the summons. I did want to start talking about other things as well. Um, I want to talk about the current packs that are available um, in the game, for the hidden potential packs, the activation packs. Now, I know a lot of other YouTubers have done this and we talked about it, uh, and I, I did want to give my piece on it too. Uh, I saw it up on Reddit and there's a whole bunch of like, stuff going around about this. I just want to say, don't buy these packs. I don't think they're worth it. I think it's Bandai's attempt to just get more, more money out of us, but it's just so blatantly obvious. It's, like, it's not even worth it. My, my thing is about this, Yadro being right, awesome. My thing about those packs is that um, it would be kind of worth it if they gave you the rainbow amount of all those orbs with the same amount or enough to max out a full character for 20, for twenty dollars. Yeah. You know, otherwise it should be maybe like $299, $399. That's the price. I think that is way, way too much freaking money for you to be purchasing those packs. If they gave one pack for $20 and it had a rainbow of every single orb in the game um, for the same amount that they're offering now, at that point, then I'd say, yeah, it's probably it's probably worth it for $20. Maybe it's a $14.99, $15.99. But overall, still $20 for one pack. It, you can't even max the character out. I think that's just enough, maybe, to get the base dupe system a month. I think the, the Reddit said about uh, 12% of a character. So I think that's not even enough to get the base dupe system unlocked of a character. Uh, I don't have the official numbers. Is this going to be a dead multi? Really? Yeah, not even an SSR. What garbage. I mean, at least I get the Elder Kai's. It's kind of why I'm doing this. I, I did kind of go hard on this, guys. I shouldn't have done this, but I really wanted to because uh, a lot of the physical characters are just really good. Um, oh yeah, then you also have the power-up pack, uh, which for the shells and the awakening medals, don't do that. That's not worth There's not even anything good in there. They should have done like a, a, a specific item that's only available in the pack and given you like 50 of them because it only comes around in a pack. You know, maybe that would make the training item one worth it. Um, and then the mysterious Elder Kai pack, everything in that one is grindable. Zenny's farmable. Um, the gems are farmable. The awakening medals are farmable. It's not worth it. These packs, I, I don't do it, guys. I'm, I'm a well. I'm considered a well in the game. I know I'm a newer YouTuber, but I am a well in this game. Uh, and I really don't find them to be worthwhile. Uh, it, it's really just more of a... I, I find, Honestly, I'm, I'm really insulted by the fact that they're doing something like that making the money making it cost so much money uh, just to get those hidden potential uh, orbs and everything else it, it, it's not worth it guys don't do it um i can't believe how dead these multis are, are right now i couldn't even i can't even get one ssr can you at least give me the super saiyan goku i don't know oh, wow that's two multis with just base srs that's such garbage um all right well we're gonna move over to the pre-recorded stuff so um i'm gonna just go ahead and do that so yeah, um, this is the last summon that I just got, so I wanted to make sure that this was up on screen. I got a whole I got a pan in this one, so this is where I actually just started doing the recording. So uh, we'll go ahead and we'll, we'll let this play in the background and just talk a little bit more about it. I'm in the game right now while, while this is playing in the background for you, and I'm just going to go into Pilos Cove just so I can give you a better idea of what's going on. I know I already spoke about it, so I, I did the Celebration Pack for $6.99. Now, Celebration Pack gave you one uh, guaranteed SSR from the uh, Baba Shop, which was worth it. 25 Dragon Stones, some Awakening Medals, which really weren't worth it. I think I even said that in the last video, and some Z-Swords. You know, it's a nice sentiment. I liked it. You know, they threw some in there. I'm not saying don't throw those in there. Always throw those in there. 
but all of them are farmable, so it's not like it matters. The Elder Kai's and Supreme Kai medals are probably a little bit more worth it, but that was a reasonable, so $7 for a premium pack for the celebration. But then we look over here at the Hidden Potential. $19.99 for the Hidden Potential. You get 600 small, 300 medium, and 20 large. And you get two Supreme Kai planets, which come every single day from mi daily mission rewards. Gravity Chambers times five. Okay, Gravity Chambers are cool, but you could farm them. They are farmable from the event. And what, 2,000 friend points, really? Who wants friend points? Come on, guys. Really? I, I don't mean to rant over here, but this is just ridiculous. And then this is supposed to be weekly. I mean, it, Bandai, I, I know that you guys go and watch the bigger YouTubers. If you happen to come across my video, uh, I'm going to say the same thing that a lot of them are saying. 1999, someone is doing something in the company that is completely wrong. You guys need to reevaluate it. We have no problem donating money, putting money into the game. Uh, four Dragonstone packs and things like that, just so that we can, you know, let the game progress. All of us love this game, but the fact that you guys were to go and do something like this, you're pretty much telling all the players to piss off. You know, I, I don't know. I'm actually a little bit agitated at the fact that you guys had had decided to do this. Um, um, if they, you know, what, honestly, two ninety nine a pack would probably be a little bit more, uh, would probably get people to purchase it, and especially because this is going to be around weekly. Just keep the same amount of content in the freaking pack drop the price and then let's just go ahead and talk about the two power-up packs $14.99 for the power-up pack uh for Gregory's 30 Gregory's 30 bubbles 30 Dr. Jaros you guys can literally go into the freaking um Baba shop you can summon on a banner first off go with uh, freaking Baba all of them and purchase Gregory's bubbles and Dr. Jaros especially when there's sales and you'll get more than what's in this freaking pack for 15 bucks then you have Popo's Master Shins and Roshi's Muti Mutaitos and Grandpa Gohan's yeah, those guys are paying the ass, but those are the ones that are definitely worth Baba shopping. And the only ones that I could say that are probably kind of worth it—that would, it would make, it would give me more incentive to purchase them if there were more—is the Kamis, uh, Gurus, Bobbities, Bibbities, and Corns. Now, personally, guys, uh, Bandai, this, I'm, I'm speaking to you. If you were to like maybe set the Gregories or add a zero onto every single one of those, the power up pack for fifteen ninety nine or fourteen, what is it, fourteen ninety nine? If you added a zero onto all of them at fourteen ninety nine. Then that power up pack would be worth it, you know. And then with like the West Kai, South Kai, East Kai, North Kai, all of them. And the same thing with the, with the freaking shells, with the training items and everything. Yeah, add a zero onto every single one of those, and then it would be worth it. And then um, here we go. And then we have what the mysterious pack, the mysterious pack for two Supreme Kai medals, two Elder Kai medals, a Hercule statue diamond, which is worth five million zenny. Yes, that's cool. But, I mean, for 5 million zenny, I'm really not going to go spend twenty four ninety nine for in-game currency. 100 incredible gems, which is farmable from the quest mode. And then you have, what, 5 Hercule Fortune Summon tickets. And that banner only contains more things that give you zenny, all Hercule statues. Bandai, I, I, don't, want, I don't mean to, like, you know, tell you you're dumb, but <laughs> you're dumb. <laughs> um, I, that's all I have to say about that. I, I think that this is a little bit ridiculous that you went and, you know, tried to get people to purchase these packs with for such a high amount of price with giving us such garbage inside of it. I mean, you know, even the fact that we that you have the price in the, inside of the actual shop to purchase stones, 91 stones for $44.99, that's ridiculous in itself. That's why everyone usually goes for your sale packs. I mean, for a game like this, yes, it's Dragon Ball Z, yes, it's popular, yes, you're making money, and people are going to spend the money. I don't know, I, I haven't found a video of a well that said that they are going to be purchasing this as of yet. At least through YouTube or on the Reddit either. I haven't found anyone on the Reddit that said, hey, I'm going to purchase this. I haven't been too active on Facebook the past week and a half because, you know, I was sick for a week. And then I got better, but I had a lot of stuff I had to catch up with. But no one on Facebook I've found so far has even said that they are going to consider pur purchasing this freaking pack. Um, yeah, guys, I don't know. I just I, don't do it. Don't do it. I'm telling you, don't do it. Boycott this. Um, you get on, get on the on the freaking train with this because there's no reason for us to ever purchase something like this. Bandai, you need to reevaluate what you've done. But anyway, that's my rant on, on that. The world tournament is currently active. I'm going into it right now, so we don't have the redstone. Um, I'm, I'm going to switch gears on, on into the actual world tournament right now. I haven't grinded yet. I'm probably going to grind a little bit tonight. I'm just going to be going for the mission rewards. I'm probably not going to. I'm not even going to go for a placement, honestly. Um, mission rewards <laughs> look at this you guys we get this almost the same amount of orbs just from grinding the tournament and you get the same amount for a rainbow variety yeah that's more worth it uh get up to 30 million points for up to three elder kai's that's the max three elder kai's two elder kai's one elder kai so that's what uh six elder kai's total just for grinding the world tournament i have so many now and all my immense damage modifier cards are maxed out at super attack right now 
and I just have a shit ton of Elder Kai's. Um, 20 worlds, uh, 20 wins in a row, get some more GSSR silver. There's a lot of silver tickets here. Um, I'm pro I might do a video at the end of the World Tournament once I get the rewards on just the silver GSSR tickets. Maybe I can get lucky and get a, like another bar off or something. Um, and then, yeah, go up to the beers tier. Nothing really special here, though, guys. It's just the basic stuff. Do the mission rewards, though. The actual prize really isn't worth it, uh, unless you're trying to go for local rankings, and then at that point, maybe you, maybe it'll be worth it for you. Uh, but overall, guys, this is pretty good. Uh, the, the boo isn't really worth it. But hey, you know what? Um, let's go ahead and wrap up this video, because, uh, yeah. Yeah, uh, just to let you know, uh, spoiler alert, uh, nothing good. <laughs> Um, but yeah, in terms of the game though, it's actually, it's not too bad, I guess, because I don't have any of the cards from the Fusion Banners. I actually have to go and grind out the event for some of those go things, the basement. So I really can't wait for that. But, um, yeah, guys, that's it. This is the last video of multi Summon that I'm going to be putting up. Rant is over. Don't purchase those packs. Go ahead, subscribe if you're new. Sorry for the long rant. It was unscripted, just anger. I wanted to do it last night, but I, had, I literally just posted up the video when someone went and you know i saw a couple of posts up on the reddit asking for youtubers to go and make videos about it inside but anyway guys thank you for joining me here today i'm gonna go out ride my motorcycle all day i'll catch you guys later